Geography is a very interdisciplinary subject and it is sometimes very difficult for the teachers in the school to talk about geography with all abstract and imaginary things. To make the children and teachers understand the 2D diagrams which are normally in the textbooks, very blurred pictures are there. Teachers are struggling to explain those because the children can't understand those blurred pictures. So you can see there are 2D models which are all made by our students. When we are making these 2D models colorful and it is attractive, children are better understanding. And there are spaces where school children also come to the geography lab to understand it is a self-learning space. Second thing, we started realizing that 2D was not sufficient. Therefore, we understood that 3D models are also required. So we started with the 3D models and these models are made of waste materials which are just lying there in your cupboard or somewhere else, we started making the materials out of low cost or no cost materials. And right now we have 3D models in that way. Those are also made by our students. For those people having visual challenge, they can understand from the tactile models. We have tactile models. Those are again made by waste materials and the regular things. It might be by the rice, pulses, etc. Many times children come here, they start understanding by touching the materials and while they touch materials there are certain things which are also organized in our geography lab which are very natural. Those might be soil samples from various parts of India. There are rock samples which are also collected from the field as well as some of the materials are also commercially purchased. But most of the things available in the geography lab are no cost or low cost. One thing we have made sure that any student, even our university or beyond our university, anyone is willing to learn how to make those models, they can also access our lab. And this geography lab is right now situated in Sannati. So anyone can go to our portal. There is a geography lab portal where they can access and they can see what is the what are the contact details.